Yeah, he certainly was. It's impossible to know what the alleged burglar was thinking. Possibly he thought he'd be getting an easy score, but he may not have been counting on cameras. Now police have his photos and his face is plastered all over social media. This man didn't know or didn't care that cameras were rolling as he broke into a Venice apartment. But as he nonchalantly walked through the living room, I saw, you know, the shape of a guy. Christopher Medak, who was paralyzed in a body surfing accident a year and a half ago. And I was like questioning whether I should shout out or not. Lay terrorized and still in his bedroom. It's gut wrenching to feel vulnerable for the first time in your life. You know, I'm a six foot one man who uh, commanded. You know, a presence, and I could take care of myself in any situation. And here I found myself completely helpless. It was early Friday morning when the Nest camera captured these shots. He spent like five minutes trying to find a way to pack up my computer on my front porch here. In the end, Medak says it was only the laptop the burglar stuffed into his bag. But Medak will also tell you he really made off with something much more valuable. You know, so yeah, I felt really pissed off, angry, violated. I mean, this guy invaded my home and he took my laptop that had my current work coming back from this accident. You know, I began shooting again. Medak, who was a first AD and photographer, has made his living with pictures. Now he's using images and the long reach of social media to land a punch, proving being in a wheelchair doesn't mean he can't fight back. Medak says the LAPD came out immediately and police now have the video and photos. Medak also says what really stood out were the man's shoes. They were red, possibly Crocs. If you've seen him or know where he might be, give Pacific Division a call. Live in Venice, Christy Fajardo, KCAL 9 News. All right, Christy.